Yo, what's going on? It's Momo Head Movement TV. Hala Mala Tala Vala. I'm with the main man, Luke Watkins. How you doing, bro? I'm wicked. But listen, I need to know about Hala Mala Tala. I hear this on all your, on all your like, Head Movement TV's movies. Yo, it's some big, deep, dark secret. You know, you have to ask Grim. Grim might be able to tell you. Sickers, you need to let me know what's going on. But yo, massive fight. Isaac Chamberlain, for me, is the pick of the fight for most of the head movement fans, the Halamala Talafala fans, is the pick of the night as well. Uh, huge fight. How do you see this one going, bro? Well, if he don't run away from me, I'll bang him out. Yeah. I'll catch him. But if he wants to get on his bike and run, I'm going to have to break him down systematically. It all depends what Isaac turns up. He's under a new team. And what was interesting is he said, oh, we're working on loads of new things. Which for me, if you're working on loads of new things, you're a jack of all and a master of none. You know, I'm, a, I'm about mastering my craft. Don't get me wrong, I work on my weaknesses, but I also work on my strengths. So for him to be learning loads of new things, he has it could to be work against him. Yeah, it can work against him. He has to be training even more and even harder. We'll see. So do you feel that you'll be the aggressor and he will be the one to not engage? Absolutely. Let, let's go... What is it? A leopard never changes his spots, right? My fights, I've always been the aggressor, okay? That's not saying that that's all I do and that's all I know, but that's always been the case. He has not always been the aggressor. He's always been... He's always tried to box and move, box and move. He's trying shit if he thinks he's going to come in and just be the aggressor and knock me out as he just stated. Bullshit, man. Obviously, um, massive second fight on. Is it the second fight on Sky Sports? Have you fought on there before? No, no, no. I fought on there before. You fought on there before. Well, the, the point I'm getting to is that you're going to be shown in America this time. And yeah. the zone, that's absolutely What's massive. What's up to the USA? And do you know what the mad thing is? I didn't even understand the fact that. I don't understand how. But somehow I've got fans from the USA. It is yeah, crazy, <laughs> honestly. Now like, you put fights on and they like to come forward, so like you said. Yeah, I must have um, and I must have received a letter in the post from America. I, mean, I was, I was honest to God, I was blown away. I couldn't believe it. Like people have taken the time out of their day to write to me from America to the UK. Yeah, it's crazy. Like, it's, yeah, that's crazy. Most but, probably one of the most humbling things I've ever felt. Yeah, but it's it's the hard work that you do. You know, the you don't you you see the hard work you do, but you'll get rewarded in such ways. Um, obviously, going back to obviously your last fight and yes. Isaac's last fight, you, you've accepted what's happened. Um, I'm actually, I quite admire how you've um, spoke about it and uh, you've just said it how it is. Yeah, I don't need, like, facts are facts. You can see it for yourself. The fight itself, there wasn't much going on in it. There wasn't much between us. Lawrence is heavy-handed. He caught me end of good night Watkins mm -hmm. on that night. And, I'm a fighter, and that's the way it goes sometimes. Pacquiao's been knocked out. Mm -hmm. um, Joshua's been knocked out. Klitschko's been knocked out. Knocked out. Fury's been knocked out. Yeah. These great warriors. Yeah. Uh, it's happened to everyone. So for me to think that it's not ever going to happen to me is quite ignorant. Of Especially at the weights that you fight at as well. These cruiserweights are you know, big, big, heavy men. So, yeah. Um, what did you make of his performance against uh, Matt Yaskin? As a fan. It wasn't, it wasn't entertaining as a fan, but I won't never slag another man off mm -hmm. and his performance, he got the job done and won. Uh, I don't, I'm not a good judge when it comes to the fight. Mm -hmm. So I always think if you don't do something clear enough that outshines the champion, I always think, uh, should they have taken it? Mm -hmm. But he won and I'm not a judge and that's not my job to yeah. judge. So congratulations to him and fair play to him. I get caught into that trap as well, but then you remember that you have to judge it 12 rounds yes. and mathematically, whoever wins most rounds and wins. Maths, ma maths don't lie. Yeah, it won't lie, numbers don't lie. So um, obviously you're hoping you're going to win this fight. What would be the next, What would be the plans going forward after this? I know I don't want to make yeah. it look too far yeah. forward, but I, uh, what kind of angle would you want to go at? Listen, there's loads of domestic fights out there for, for all these cruiserweights. Someone, someone, whoever, like, whoever people deem as names mm -hmm. and, you know, they want to see people fight, that's the guy I want to be known as. But that guy didn't duck no one, he, you know, he, he was willing to fight anyone, and I am. And you did, you proved that with the Akoli fight? Yeah, yeah, so if, if, if that's By what, taking the fight? Yeah, if people want to say that, oh, like, you know, I'm willing to do that, hence why 
I don't care about the fight that I come back to. Mm -hmm. I want to. I want to stay at this level. This is where. It, this is what it's about. This is what I enjoy, man. I love coming away from home. I love. I love. <laughs> I love all the media stuff. I love the workouts. I love everything about my sport. Do you know what I mean? This, yeah. is, this is my passion. This is it. It's the life. Um, before I let you go, just quickly now, very briefly, prediction for the fight. Mine. Yeah, your fight. Listen, like I said, if he wants to run away, I might have to systematically break him down and catch up with him maybe a little bit later because he's going to be running. Mm. But if he comes to fight and he wants to go toe to toe, woof, he could go early. Yeah, but I just know my arms being raised. That's perfect, my friend. Um, Luke, the Duke Watkins with Momo Head Movement TV. Halamala, Talavala. Halamala, Talamala. <laughs> yes. Thank, thank you very much, my brother.